Crypto mining. What is crypto mining? The Bitcoin network holds a lottery every few minutes. Every computer competes to guess a 64-digit hexadecimal number known as a hash. The faster the computer, the higher the reward. The process known as mining has been around over a decade. However, recently the IRS has started cracking down on cryptocurrency owners and traders. Why crypto mining is considered a legitimate business and can result in tax deductions, it is also a hobby for many. Crypto mining uses blockchain technology to create new units of cryptocurrency. The process is simple and does not require pickaxes or other heavy equipment. Instead of using a physical device to mine cryptocurrency, a computer processor chips away at complex math problems. It is completely transparent and not subject to government regulation. As a result, it can be the idea option for many people, from the average consumer to business owners. The cost of the graphics processor is a big part of the business, so many companies have turned to crypto mining for an affordable, reliable way to increase revenue. The process is also a significant environmental and power-intensive process. In fact, one Bitcoin miner is estimated to consume more electricity than the entire country of Finland. Because of its costs, miners tend to conjugate in areas with cheap electricity prices. This causes additional pressure on outdated infrastructures and exasperates the problem of global warming. In addition, the cost of mining hardware can be quite expensive. A high-spec mining rig can easily cost more than $10 USD. For most people, using digital money is a benefit. With digital payment services, it's easy to buy things online or send money to friends and family. There is also no need for paper, cash, or coin currencies. Everybody's interests, goals, and needs are different. So the choice of a cryptocurrency miner depends on what you're looking for in your life. Once you're ready, you can start earning a living from crypto mining. The process is also popular among many people and the benefits are many. The first is that it can be a lucrative investment. It makes it easy to earn money by selling goods and offering services. And it allows you to participate in the cryptocurrency world as you want. It's an incredible experience and can be very rewarding for you and your family. This is one of the most exciting opportunities for anyone interested in cryptocurrency. If you are interested, try it. The process of crypto mining involves gathering transactions and adding them to a block of data known as a blockchain. These transactions are added to the blockchain and are verified by a group of miners. This prevents double spreading and keeps a permanent and moderable record of transactions and it's easy to use. The process is resource intensive and costly, so early Bitcoin miners can use a PC to mine. Fortunately, with modern technology, a PC can be used to perform the mining process. Why crypto mining has become a lucrative alternative to traditional banking? It's still very expensive and requires specialized computing resources. While a PC can mine Bitcoin, it is inefficient and requires a high-powered GPU or a separate mining machine. If you have a lot of spare computing power, you can use it for other purposes as well, such as distributing the coins to charities. In some cases, people can earn money from crypto mining by using a PC. The cryptocurrency market offers an alternative to traditional banking systems. To get the most out of cryptocurrency mining, you must understand the difference between a centralized and decentralized system. In a centralized system, a central authority maintains a consolidated record of every transaction. This is a limited system, so a person can't make much money from it. Therefore, it's important to know what you're doing before you begin to mine cryptocurrencies. The first step is to learn about the cryptocurrency market. It is an alternative to the traditional banking system. To get a better understanding of crypto mining, it's important to understand the difference between a centralized and decentralized system. In a centralized system, there is a central authority that records every transaction and restricts how people can use the money. In a decentralized system, there's no centralized authority. In a decentralized system, everyone on the network has a shared ledger. So hopefully that can be helpful for you to understand a little bit more about crypto mining. Let's go ahead and dive in as how does crypto mining work? Crypto mining is a process by which a computer solves complex mathematical, mathematical equations in exchange for Bitcoins. The miner is rewarded with Bitcoin and any transaction fees that are associated with the block. The process repeats itself until a new block is added to the chain. A typical mining rig includes all the PC components, storage, and a power source. 
Although the first Bitcoin miners used personal computers to solve this equation, today's mining setups are much more sophisticated. Unlike the traditional banking system, cryptocurrency has no central authority or single point of failure. Every transaction on the network is recorded in a public database. The blockchain prevents tampering by keeping a permanent and mutable record of all transactions. This prevents double spreading and is also a great way to increase security. In a sense, crypto mining is a great way to make money, but it's not for everyone. This process works by gathering all the transactions and adding them to a public record. Each transaction is added to a list and added to an unconfirmed block. For example, if you wanted to send money to Jake and you would need to add, add these uh, Bitcoin payments to Jake's Bitcoin account, this prevents double spreading and keeps a permanent immutable record. As long as everyone is participating, the profit is shared among the miners. The cryptocurrency market is an alternative to the traditional banking system. To understand the process of crypto mining, you should understand the difference, again, between a centralized and decentralized system. In traditional banking, there is a central authority that maintains a centralized record of every transaction and a centralized database. As such, the system is highly restricted and prone to hacks. The blockchain is more secure, which makes it an attractive investment and immutable, makes it an excellent choice for people who want to make money. There are several advantages to becoming a crypto miner. Besides the fact that it's a highly lucrative business, it also allows you to make a significant impact on the world economy. As long as you understand the difference between a centralized system and a decentralized one, you can start mining right away. Once you get your first transaction, you'll be able to earn a few Bitcoins a day. A simple website will give you the information you need. The primary advantage of a decentralized system is that it is more secure than a centralized one. Instead of relying on a central authority, a decentralized system is open and completely transparent. In this way, it has no centralized authority that keeps track of your transactions. And unlike centralized systems, it is not regulated. For example, the Bitcoin blockchain is not governed by a centralized authority, but by a global network. In addition to this, there are a number of other benefits of crypto mining. The biggest benefit is that it requires no special computer skills. For example, a computer with an advanced graphic card can be used to perform a large number of calculations. It will also have a high amount of CPU power, which is a major advantage for the industry. Further, it can help you make extra money. If you have enough money, you can even use your crypto wallet to purchase goods. In addition to being more secure, cryptocurrency mining is a resource intensive and complex idea. A PC with a graphics card can perform the Bitcoin mining though, but you won't allow be allowed to store the cryptocurrency. During the mining process, a computer processor can process thousands of transactions per second, but it's very slow. If you're not good at math, you can easily lose your money in the process. Nonetheless, there are a lot of other benefits to crypto mining. Besides the benefits of digital money, cryptocurrency mining also allows you to earn extra income. Compared to a bank, cryptocurrency mining is not a business where you can make a fortune. You can earn cash through it, sell goods online, and transfer money to friends and family. While the process may require a lot of effort, it's not hard to make an income from crypto. The key is to invest early and learn the technology. So I hope that's helped. We're gonna move a little bit further in and we're gonna talk about the popularity of the cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin and the feeling of the number of cryptocurrencies on the market. Bitcoin has fueled the development of not only a number of cryptocurrency mining, but operations around the world. These mining operations are usually powered by GPUs, which are specialized computers. These powerful machines are very expensive. So many people are forced to buy them. Some of them even go out of business due to a lack of capital. If you're considering becoming a crypto miner, here are some things that you should know. Before you get started, you need to consider whether mining is profitable for your needs. The profitability of a mining operation depends on the amount of electricity and power consumption and a GPU can produce significant amounts of heat. If you're not careful, these devices can easily catch on fire. However, you can always choose to mine for cryptocurrency on your own, though it's not recommended since the reward for mining is very small. That's why most miners prefer mining pools. In these pools, all the miners work together to solve one block, which increases the likelihood of being validated and thus increases the chances of earning a block reward. The profitability of mining Bitcoins depends on the type of hardware used. 
Currently, an NVIDIA RTX 3080 can generate $139 a month in Bitcoin if used for commercial purposes. This is a huge sum, but keep in mind that the GPU will cost about $1,400 when purchased according to January 2022. Ultimately, it is better to purchase a GPU that has the necessary processing power and is not prone to crashes. In addition to GPUs, you can also invest in a mining pool to increase your profitability. While the hardware costs are relatively low, the expenses are cut from your profit. The larger the pool, the more hashing power you'll be able to mine with. A mining pool that has many miners will be more likely to validate a block. The benefits of this type of pooling are many. A Bitcoin miner can earn as much as $24,000 a month why mining Bitcoin can be done on your own and requires a high level of computing power. Despite its simplicity, cryptocurrency mining requires a high level of expertise in mathematics and computer systems. A strong computer will allow you to solve complex mathematical problems, and the more powerful your machine, the better. The rewards tend to decline over time, but it's still a good investment. Besides, the cost of a mining pool will be minimum compared to the benefits of cryptocurrency. Although, the thing about Bitcoin and unlike Bitcoin is that when you are using a mining pool, you have to be understanding of the benefits of it to the cryptocurrency. Bitcoin is not a variable alternative for everyone and has advantages and disadvantages. Why Bitcoin has its pros and cons, the biggest downsides of crypto mining are its price volatility and the risk of fire. Moreover, it's important to remember that a mining pool will have fewer fees than a single person miner. This means that you can afford to purchase more GPUs and ASICs as necessary, but you need to invest in a mining pool if you want to maximize your profits. Crypto mining requires a strong computer and knowledge in computing. A powerful computer will be needed to mine Bitcoin effectively. Additionally, it is important to consider the cost of electricity if you're planning to mine. Some cryptocurrency exchanges are only profitable if they are traded on exchanges. But if you're a beginner, you can try mining for a few coins at a time. There are no fees, so make sure you check before you buy. When you're looking for a cryptocurrency mining pool, it's best to start with the most popular uh, excuse me, the most not only popular, but also the most profitable coins. This can be achieved through a mining pool with a lot of participants, uh, a lot of participants and participants that are encouraged to make profits. You can also opt for a mining pool with a small minimum number of users. This is idea if you're only starting to mine for a few coins and are looking for a more stable environment. You can easily start a crypto mining pool with a small pool. The first step in a mining pool is a collective of individual miners that pool their resources and efforts to mine various coins. It is vital to find a mining pool with a large number of members in order to achieve the best results. A large pool will enable a lot more hashing power than a small pool, but it will still require a higher minimum. While mining alone is not possible to earn block rewards, for that reason, most miners opt for a mining pool. The group will use their efforts to become more likely validated as a block. So let's look into how to mine cryptocurrency. As the amount of cryptocurrency increases, more people are investing their money in crypto mining. However, there are some risks involved, especially when it comes to mining Bitcoins. For example, it can take hours to start the process and even more time to finish it. This is why you should consider your investment as the process is extremely high risk and can be expensive. To reduce these risks, we'll take a look at the basis of crypto mining. To consider before you start mining the cryptocurrencies, you want to know these risks. While the initial cost can be relatively low, you need to cover ongoing expenses. Also consider any legal or environmental issues before you begin your venture. Remember that mining cryptocurrencies can be a lucrative business, but the risks involved are very high. If you're not sure whether cryptocurrency mining is for you, read about the advantages and disadvantages of mining. There's nothing wrong with using a process to make money. The cost of crypto mining can add up fast. The initial cost can exceed $10,000. The ongoing cost can add up quickly, and you need to cover the ongoing cost as well. If you're considering a career in crypto mining, be sure to consider the financial risk and legal implications before making a final decision. You need to be aware of the process's potential for environmental damage and the possible risks to your health. Moreover, it's important to understand the potential for profit and the cost of mining operations. Before investing in a mining business, be sure to understand the process. You need to know upfront 
the pays and the upgoing expenses. In addition, you need to know and think about any potential legal or environmental implications of mining and the financial risk involved. Once you're established and the business model is found the right hardware and software, you can start collecting and storing cryptocurrency you've earned. That's a lucrative business for you and the rewards are worth it. You can invest in cryptocurrency mining by purchasing a computer. Using the cost of purchasing the computer and the computing power will depend on the amount of coins you want to mine. The average miner's profit will vary greatly, but initially the investment will depend on the size of your rig and the level of experience you have. In addition, you need a good operating system and environment to access the internet. There is a lot of potential in crypto mining, but it's important to understand that it's not for everyone. Cryptocurrency mining is a great way to earn money. It's easy to start a cryptocurrency mining business, but you need to invest the time and money to set up and maintain it properly. While there are several ways to make money with it, the initial investment is often the most important consideration. For beginners, GPU mining is the easiest and cheapest method why ASIC mining is the most expensive and complicated. Regardless of your preference, it's important to consider the risks and benefits of cryptocurrency mining before you invest your hard-earned cash. The initial cost is higher than of other investments. This is because the mining process is more complex and involves many steps. There is a large upfront cost as well. Once you start mining, you have to pay monthly. As you see, the initial cost is not small and it will keep increasing. If you're looking to make money from crypto mining, you should invest in the right software to make money. And the process itself is simple, but requires knowledge and investment knowledge. There are several pros and cons to crypto mining. The process can be expensive, but it's not impossible. If you're serious about crypto mining, you must understand the process and learn how it works. Take the time. If you're planning to invest in crypto mining, you should consider the upfront and ongoing costs as well as an environmental impact. Then consider whether it's right for you and your family. This is the best way to make the best investment possible and make the best decision. ASICs are a popular choice for cryptocurrency mining. These are powerful machines that can mine cryptocurrency. They have a low cost and are ideal for people who want to start mining Bitcoin. You need to have a GPU or AS, ASIC machine to start mining. This will be your primary computer and should be equipped with a GPU. A GPU will be more efficient than a CPU, but it won't be as powerful. The biggest advantage is the ability to choose what's best for you. So thank you for watching this video. Please take this information and use it to your needs.